But anyways, family, here's the latest Bitcoin price prediction from ARK Invest, Kathy Wood. She says the Bitcoin price target will go well above $1 million per coin. In fact, ARK Invest says Bitcoin can be worth $2.3 million per coin if this happens. So let's break this down. If you're just joining the stream, pump the likes. The pump the stream, there's almost a thousand people here live with us. Greatly appreciate the support. So yeah, brand new headline right here. I'm going to read this to you. Bitcoin will hit a million sooner than 2030. The CEO of Asset Manager, ARK Invest, has said in a brand new interview with the New Zealand Herald on March 7th, Kathy Wood revealed new expectations for institutional involvement for the Bitcoin price growth. As you know, Bitcoin has transformed since the launch of the United States. First spot, Bitcoin ETFs, according to Kathy Wood. Speaking before a mainstream media audience, the well-known Bitcoin bull doubled down on her existing conviction over the largest cryptocurrencies future, such as the interest and momentum behind the spot ETFs. She explained that even ARK itself had been forced to reevaluate how bullish it is on the King Crypto, BTC. Previously, the firm's price target focused on $1 million per coin by the year 2030. Now that roadmap is changing, quoting Kathy Wood. That target is, was before the SEC gave us the green light. And I think that was a major milestone. And it has pulled forward the timeline, she explained, referring to the regulatory nod from U.S. regulator, the SEC. Wood continued that no major wirehouse names such as Morgan Stanley, Merrill Lynch, or Bank of America has yet joined the institutional push. Quitting her again, no platform has approved Bitcoin yet. So all of this price action has happened before they approve it. And so we haven't even begun. And taking this into account, 1 million by 2030 now seems too conservative. Let me know if you agree or disagree with Kathy Wood, quitting her again. Our target is above that. It's well above that. And with our new expectations for institutional involvement, the incremental price that we assume for institutions actually has more than doubled. Let's freaking go. And as Bitcoin circles new all-time highs yet again, I mean, we already touched 70,000 multiple times today, family. Price discovery mode, now 100,000 is in play. I think we trend towards this target leading into the halving, but let me know your thoughts, family. Uh, and quoting James Van Stratton, a Bitcoin can pass 70,000 before the Coinbase circuit breaker happens. True price discovery. That's right. Three times that I'm aware of this week, we eclipsed 70,000. And what happened? Coinbase freaking went down, which is crazy, right? Now, do you think that is all orchestrated by design or do you think just a random coincidence. Let me know your thoughts. And I want to read you these other headlines. What's behind Kathy Wood's ARC estimate for Bitcoin to surge to 2.3 million? Another headline, Kathy Wood thinks that Bitcoin can soar over 3,600%. Is it time to buy? And this headline, ARC Invest says Bitcoin could be worth 2.3 million if this happens. So I want to break down this 2.3 million price prediction. According to ARK Invest Analysis, a portfolio seeking to maximize risk-adjusted returns on a five-year time frame from 2015 would have allocated just a half a percent into BTC. Since then, on the same basis, the average allocation to the digital asset would have been 4.8 percent, while in 2023 alone, such portfolios would have allocated 19.4 Based on an analysis of a 1% allocation from the $250 trillion global investable asset base, it could push Bitcoin to 120,000, allocating 4.8%. Average maximum sharp ratio from 2015 to 2023 can cause Bitcoin to soar to 550,000, and Bitcoin can skyrocket to 2.3 million following the 19.4% allocation in 2023, as she shares here. Bitcoin's volatility can obfuscate its long-term returns. While significant appreciation or depreciation can occur over the short term, a long-term investment horizon has been key to investing in Bitcoin instead of when the better question is for how long. Historically, investors who bought and held Bitcoin for at least five years have profited no matter when they made their purchases. Now, on the other hand, the optimal portfolio allocation targets for assets like gold, commodities, bonds, and equities in 2023 on a five-year time horizon, just like Bitcoin, are 40%, 9.6%, 0%, and 30%, respectively. I also want to point out BlackRock published a report. Uh, this was a couple of years ago, and they said their recommended Bitcoin 
Bitcoin allocation for a portfolio, 84.9%. Shout out Arlindo. I appreciate you subscribing to the pod. Now, what if hypothetically they would allocate 85% as BlackRock, the world's largest asset manager, recommends? You run the math. That's when things get really crazy. Yeah, you know I mean, because going from 20% to virtually 60% would be 3x that price target, which can take us in the multiple millions of dollars per coin, just as Kathy Wood is insisting with 2.4, with a 19.4% allocation. So where do you feel the Bitcoin price is likely to go? And what's your thoughts on this 2.4 million Bitcoin price prediction from ARK Invest? Is Kathy Wood, drop your comments in the live chat.